Hi everyone, Anna VSG. Anna VSG? I, I don't know, I should probably learn my name. Um, I am coming to you on a Friday, super early than my usual. Um, usual. I've made just a few videos, but Mondays are supposedly the times um, or the days that I'm going to be posting. But um, I went to Trader Joe's today. I have every other Friday off of work and uh, decided um, that I got some really good stuff that I'd like to share with you all. So um, excuse my really ugly kitchen, by the way. We just moved into this house about a year ago, and this is one of our big projects um, over be right behind my shoulder here you can tell uh the decorative stone that was put up um i've been living it with <laughs> with it for about a year and it's driving me nuts along with the cabinets and it's it's just horrible but anyhow excuse the kitchen someday it will be redone um so one of the reasons i went to trader joe's this morning is because i was watching uh jody vsg's um video and she is like my new obsession i love you jody so much uh thank you so much for all your uh, helpful comments on my uh, vlog so far. Um, you're you're amazing, and um, I love how positive you are, and it's really helpful, um, girl. I've been drinking tons of water, and it's working. So um, I think I'm gonna step that up uh, from now on because it definitely makes a difference. Um, okay, so what did I get at Trader Joe's? I haven't even looked at my bags yet. Um, okay, my I, coffee. I love coffee. Um, I drink coffee every day. Um, I wasn't very good about uh, staying off of it. So um, I waited about four weeks, I think, before I started drinking again. And now it, it tastes different to me, so I don't drink as much. Um, and I also cut it with a protein shake. I usually use half of a Premier uh, vanilla protein uh, shake and I put, so I use, what is that, five and a half ounces. And then I put eight ounces of coffee and that's what I have all day. So for me, it's the taste. I like the taste of coffee. Um, not so much. I, I never drank a ton. I only drank about 20 ounces a day. But um, I don't know. I like the taste of coffee. So so sue me. Um, I got a little snack. Um, the other thing. I got a little snack. Uh, it is a wasabi roasted seaweed snack. Um, I've had, I've made it. I've, I've made it. I've, uh, I've had the regular what roasted before uh, this is wasabi uh, so I'm hoping it has a little bit of a kick um might be good it has let's see per serving is like half the package um, which has two grams of fat one carb one fiber so and it has a gram of, of protein um, I just want something different um, to, to eat or snack on I feel like I never have any snacks anymore and I'm so tired of dairy and meat and I just need something different so um I'm all about taste got some green dragon hot sauce and um we'll see flavor it's all about flavor okay so here is the reason that I wanted to go to Trader Joe's today because I was watching Jody's video like I mentioned and it was an older one I think and she was uh, cooking up, um, she did, I think it was the one where she put together her rinse dressing. Um, and then she also made this burger, the pizza veggie burger. And it's got tomato, basil, and mozzarella cheese. And it looks so yummy. Um, and the stats on it it's a hundred it's a one burger one patty is 130 calories uh, total fat is seven uh, total carbs uh, seven but it has four grams of fiber and two grams of sugar and nine protein so um, I love this I love this love this so I'm really excited I actually ended up getting two packages um, because yum um, the other thing I, I have gotten uh, before I eat a lot of fish and I really, really enjoyed these. Um, they are the Mahi Mahi Burgers, um, also from Trader Joe's, can you see that? Um, and these, I think, have fantastic uh, stats. Uh, 110, let's see, 110 calories, total fat is five grams, uh, carbs, one, one carb, and then you get 15 grams of protein. These are so tasty, and they're very, 
I, I can almost make it through a whole one, um, but um, they're, they're light and they're not, they're, I don't know, I, I just really like them. I typically will have them with um, a little bit of avocado, uh, a little bit of sauce on it. So what, whatever you like, um, just love this stuff. Um, all right, next thing is, yay, um, I got almond meal just almond meal and the reason I got almond meal is because I'm going to give the fat head pizza crust a, a try I made last video I was talking about how much I miss pizza and I made a, a chicken crust pizza so where you take ground chicken with cheese it's parmesan and mozzarella and you cook that as the the, the base and then you put your toppings on it um, it was good. It was just really, really heavy. I just, I just felt like it was just too much all at once. So my husband loved it. My in-laws loved it. So I know I'll make it again because, um, everyone liked it and it's, I think it's better because it's high protein for everyone, but, um, it was just too much for me. So I'm just going to give the, um, the fat head crust a, a try because I think it will be a little bit lighter, lighter. Um, the other thing that I bought, excuse me, I'm still here. I think I went a little bit overboard on this, but um, I bought a pack of fresh rice cauliflower um, as well as two of the frozen rice cauliflower. And I'm going to give the cauliflower crust um, a try as well. So um, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Um, I'm not obsessed with pizza, I promise you, but I want to have it as an option. If my husband decides that he and my daughter want pizza for the night, I want to be able to have pizza and I want to not, um, I'm not, like I mentioned before, I'm not supposed to eat any bread or pita or rice or pasta for nine months. So I'm, I'm trying really hard to adhere to that. So this is my way around it. So um, I do believe that I shouldn't give, I shouldn't have to give up things um, to do this. I, I, I know I have to give up things, but I shouldn't have to give up everyday things. And I'm really trying to stay within the bounds of the rules that the doctor have given me, but still live as normally as possible. Um, and so far, so good. So um, it just takes a little bit of thinking, a little bit of <sighs> working around like the pizza crust, just just trying new things. I'm a cook, so I I love new recipes and trying new ways of doing things, so I don't mind this at all. Um, I love fish, so um, they have these little packs of smoked salmon um, for like four bucks. So there's two, um, let's see, serving size is two ounces, so it's perfect. Uh, six total fat. This has really high carbs. Four carbs and... 11 protein um the salmon i've gotten previously at costco has like one carb um so i didn't i don't know why i didn't look at that but that's still that's still okay um for the amount i'll probably eat um it's fine uh just spices in that bag um the other thing um zucchini i love using zucchini as pasta noodles or as noodles. Um, I've tried the shirataki mushroom um, pasta and it's okay. I don't love it. Um, I don't like how chewy it is. I don't care about the smell. I think it's fine. But um, I prefer the mouthfeel and texture of the zucchini noodle and my husband and daughter absolutely love them. So um, something that works for all three of us is, is the best thing. So, um, I got two. Yay. So we, I probably make this five times a week and my husband even said he prefers it over pasta because, um, it doesn't make him feel real heavy and it works so well with, um, like a meat sauce. It's, it's perfect. Um, what else? Oh, this is, I love this stuff. This is creamy goat cheese. It's just these little packets. And I have a neg almost daily 
um, in the morning. So I typically will throw some kind of cheese in it. Um, I do like a, an omelet um, and I'll throw some cheese in there and some um, like deli ham meat and or the salmon. Um, and the goat cheese, if you like goat cheese, this is great. This is creamy goat cheese. Um, typically I just put in about an ounce and this container for an ounce serving has four and a half servings. Uh, there's 45 calories, um, total three and a half are coming from fats. It's, you know, it's cheese. It's, it's going to be a little higher in fat. Total carb is only one and it has three grams of protein per, um, per ounce. So I love it when I can get my protein in, um, in ways like this, um, that don't require a lot of bulk because we can't handle a lot of bulk. So, um, I think that's about it on my haul. I don't, I don't know how I spent that, that much money, but, um, I have some, oh, I, bought, I also bought some edamame, um, frozen edamame, deshelled. Um, I don't know, I don't know if I can eat them yet. Um, my doctor has said just focus on protein, not vegetables right now. I love vegetables. I'm obviously eating the zucchini, so I'm going against those rules. Um, so um, I'll give them a try, and if I like them, I like them, and I'll eat them. So that's the way it's going to be. Um, what else? Oh, I... Um, I think that's it. <laughs> um, I, I didn't plan this out very well. I just, I was driving home and I thought, oh, I'm going to do this. But I want to thank Jody again um, because um, if, I, I think I've walked past these so many times and I've looked and I'm like, eh, nah, and I never looked at the stats and they are really, really great because I looked at the other veggie burgers and they had like 20 carbs and two grams of fiber. So these are fantastic and um, I'm really excited to try them. I think I'm going to have one for lunch today. So, all right. I think that's it, everyone. Thank you so much uh, for listening to my rambling and oh my gosh, 12 minutes and a half, 12 and a half minutes. Um, that's it. I will, I promise I will post a video either Monday evening or Tuesday evening. I'm not sure um, when I'll have time. Uh, with update on my stats. Um, have a fantastic weekend, a wonderful Mother's Day. Um, bye.